Hey guys, I'm Jessica Graham Pixie. Welcome back to the channel. I have to tell you, this is probably the most excited I've ever been to film any video on my channel. Today I'm decorating my office. So, I bought probably way too much stuff. If you want to see everything that I got, where I got it, the whole shopping vlog, then I will link it up here. I will also put it in the description and at the end of this video. But today we're gonna go ahead and go for my office. So I am doing a whole like pink peppermint and black licorice type theme in here. Everything is red, pink, black, white. Super, super excited. If you hear like a lawnmower in the back, the lawn guy is around, so just ignore that. But I am totally ready to get into the festive move. I even got my festive Christmas socks on which I'm so excited, I got those at Marshalls by the way. So let's go ahead and get into it. I am going to show you all the stuff. I laid everything I have out for this room on the floor, so let's go and show you that. So we have lots of pink and red and white and black. You can see there are like all of my tree pips. I'm trying to stick to those basic colors and silver for the tree. And then I've got my new stockings, some Walmart ornaments, Dollar Tree ornaments, lots of different stuff that I get to play with and they, those are my red pillows that are going to go on my couch. So first up we are going to start with the tree that I got from Walmart. He is already up and ready to be decorated so I'm going to put on Home Alone and let's get decorating. So first thing I started with was this really beautiful peppermint sort of print ribbon that I got from Walmart. And I cut this into strips. I have actually never done this before. Usually I just do the basic like weave in and out, either in a sort of like candy cane pattern, like a barbershop pole, going around the tree, or going straight up and straight down, or straight across, and just kind of like pushing it into the tree branches. But this year I decided to try this, and I have to say I really, really loved it. So I just kind of stuck them in there willy-nilly and just went with it. It looks like the ribbon is weaving through the tree because I did this, and I have to say I really love this style of ribbon. I definitely am going to use this from year to year and play up a little bit more with my Christmas trees. And I just love this print of ribbon. It is so beautiful and it actually has a little bit like a velvet feel to it. Then I went in with this Dollar Tree uh, pink feather boa that I got. I got two of these. That's all they had so I bought them out and I just cut little clips of it and just shoved it in the tree. Again willy-nilly just kind of randomly wherever felt like it needed it. I wish I had gotten more but again I pretty much bought them out so it's not bad. I do wish, looking back at it, that it had more of the feathers, though. I definitely think next year I will add a lot more feathers to this tree. Then I grabbed this, they're sort of like fluorescent beaded garland from Walmart, and I did sort of like scoop droplets all over and down the tree. I think it turned out so pretty. It caught the light really, really nice on these little beads, so I'm very, very glad that I picked this up. I got, grabbed two of those from Walmart, and they were like a dollar a piece, you guys. Walmart Christmas decorations, I tell you, it is seriously the best. I think maybe next year, though, I'll add some pearls as well. I was actually looking for pearls this year, but I saw these and thought they were very, very pretty, so I gave them a shot, but I kind of want to mix it up with pearls, too. Then I picked up these silver Christmas tree picks. Again, these were from Walmart, and I just shoved these into the tree wherever I felt like I wanted a little bit more pop. I love that these add a little bit more texture to your Christmas tree and make it look maybe a little bit more wild but still just very glamorous because of all that silver glitter and believe me that glitter is all over my office now. I will be vacuuming up this office for months to come but it's totally worth it. I am a glitter fanatic. Tell me in the comments if you guys like glitter in your Christmas decor or if it's just not worth it to you because I'll clean up. For me, nothing can ever sparkle too much. <laughs> Thank you. 
Then I thought that I might use these little white pom-poms, but I actually decided against that, so I'm gonna use that somewhere else in my office. And I picked up these pink glitter poinsettias. I got four of these and I just kind of shoved them randomly throughout the tree. Only the front. I definitely didn't decorate the back of the tree this year, I'll be honest with you. I just kind of weighted it with old Christmas ornaments to make sure it doesn't lean too far forward. But I love these poinsettias. I think they're so beautiful. Again, these were Walmart and about a dollar a piece, so a great deal. Then I grabbed these black and white striped bows. I think these are so beautiful. These would work really beautifully too if you have a sort of like Parisian themed tree or like a beauty shop themed tree would be really cute too. I love these bows and I just scattered them throughout the tree. I feel like when I'm using or, or decora decorations like this, I kind of go in a zigzag pattern. So I just zigzag across the tree that way it's somewhat evenly distributed and then I go back at the end and pop any extra in. You can see I'm laughing at Home Alone. It is my favorite movie. Home Alone and Home Alone 2. They are probably my favorite Christmas movies ever. Then I put on the tree topper. I opted for this really cute white and red kind of a candy striper um, big bow. Again this was Walmart and I love this bow. I think it's so cute. But for me, I felt like it needed a little extra something. So I also grabbed these really cute silver picks and I put these in the back of the bow. Then I went in with these, it's, it's a weird sort of like white burlap, but with black trim ribbon. So they're really similar to the black and white stripe, but they almost are a little bit more rustic I would say like I feel like this would look okay if you had a farmhouse decor I think it's really cute so if you go with like the black and white themed farmhouse decor I think this would be a great bow for you to pick up again Walmart Walmart for the win this year man they did great then I went in with the biggest baubles that I had so I grabbed these massive silver uh, globe ornaments from Dollar Tree and I scattered four of them throughout the tree. I started with those because they were the biggest ornaments that I had. And then I went in with more of my Dollar Tree ornaments. These were the glitzy glammy ones. So they're the ones that are glitter and white and cream and have these little mirrored chips on them, like mosaic mirrors. So they add a lot of glamor to your Christmas tree for a very good price. And again, I scattered those throughout the tree, trying to make it as even as possible. Then I went in with these small little red Christmas tree baubles. So these are actually in the mini tree ornament section at Walmart, but I love them just to add that little bit of extra pop. And then I felt like the tree topper needed a little something, so I went in with these Dollar Tree Christmas uh, picks, just a little bit more red on top. And then again, I feel like it, something was just still missing. So I grabbed my red velvet ribbon from Michaels and I just cut little strips of that and popped it in randomly throughout the tree. And I think that this was the like chef's kiss to the tree. I feel like it just finished it off. I was not crazy about it before this. As soon as I got that red ribbon in, I was like, there you go. That's what I was looking for. checking out my work and that is it you guys this is how my office decor tree went up this year I love this tree it really does feel like peppermint and black licorice just screaming on top of this tree I'm so happy with it it's so fun and so festive and still really really girly and pretty and soft If you guys liked this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe for more content from me. I'm going to be doing a lot of Christmas videos this season. Uh, two videos every single week for you guys, so I hope that you enjoyed this one.
look out for more Christmas decor videos from me. And until next time, you guys, bye.